Rich Guzzo here with GolfAggressive.com and today we're going to cover posture and how that can lead to inconsistencies in your golf game. And I think just starting out, um, I'll give you some basic fundamentals that I think you should instill in your game, um, but then also highlight a few of those inconsistencies that will lead to, if you do have a, say if you're back on your heels and leaning back, what that actually generates in your golf swing. So to start out, uh, it's always good, maybe just put a ball on a tee I've got a six iron today. So what I want to start out, I've got my feet shoulder width apart. With posture, I'm concerned more about how you've set up your lower body and your upper body. So make an even plant on your feet. I don't want you to be too far on your heels or too far on your toes. Because if we get back to what that generates in the inconsistencies, if I'm too far back on my heel, my swing plane is typically going to be, so if I'm back here, it's going to come on the inside and then to, in order to get back through the ball i'm going to try and come over it so try and feel like when you get your even stance bounce both up make sure that the weight is right along the center portion of your your feet another good point is you can get away with ball position if you play every day and you have good hand eye coordination but it's crucial that you have a consistent ball position and set up with your hands because if it's too far forward or it's too far back, that's going to generate the inconsistencies on your takeaway and your follow through. So good one from here is I lightly bend on my feet. I'm going to bend from my hips. So if I stand up straight, I've lightly bend with my, my, my legs and I'm going to bend through my hips right here. And then I'm letting my hands drop down. So how this will look over the ball, is I've set up the club, I've got my feet set, I've just lightly planted, making sure the weight is even. I've bent from the hips, and now I'm dropping my hands down, and that's where I want my club. So from this position, I've set up perfectly with my posture. I'm not too far back on my heels, I'm just gonna create that drag from the inside, and I'm not too far over on my toes. And from here, you can take a nice balanced swing and rotating along your spine because that's the goal here you don't want to if you're leaning back it's hard to rotate on that spine and keeping it still so if you have a good posture set up that spine angle straight through allows you to rotate through so we'll do it again i've got my feet planted up making sure my weight you can do a quick bounce make sure my weight's evenly distributed got my hands drop straight down in a good position Bent from the hips down. Now I can just take a nice smooth swing and straight through. And that really is it. So if you work on your fundamentals when it comes to pressure on your feet, bending from the, the lower body, not too much, you don't wanna to go too far low. Bend from the hips down, drop that hand. The hands is the critical component to it. If you find that you've done everything right here, you've bent from the hips, but you're out here, you're gonna come on the inside. So. Make sure you've got that consistency of where those hands are in that ball position, and that should help when it comes to creating that perfect posture and giving that consistency on the golf course. So take that to the range and let us know how that does.